In this video, you'll learn how to brand a video using Windows Movie Maker. Then you can take this video and you can upload it to any video services, or if you're selling a video and you don't want anybody to have the rights to sell it, you can brand it with your company name or your website name. Now, the first thing you're going to need is Windows Movie Maker, which is free software that's most likely already on your computer. The next thing you need to do is have a video that's either in WMV, which is Windows Movie Maker format, or in AVI format. Then what you want to do is import your media. So just click on this to import your media from your computer. Then you can import as many as you want because they're just coming into the clip bin. Okay, so here it is in the clip bin. Now all you have to do is drag it down to the timeline by left-clicking your mouse, holding it down, and then drop it into the timeline. Next thing you want to do is go into Tools and then go into Titles and Credits. Then click Title on Selected Clip. And then you key your text in here. And you can put whatever you want here, just your website name, not for sale, property of, website name or whatever. So we'll just put property or we'll say see more at and then website name. Okay, and you see it shows up in the preview window over here. Now what you can do is you can go and change the animations, which we want to do first. And I, you can use any of these you want, but I like to use the fly in and fly out. As you see, it flies in and it flies back out again. And then what we can do is we can go change the fonts and so on and the size. So let's, we can also change the color here. So I'm going to change it to black. And then what we're going to do is we're going to reduce the size so that it all fits on one line. Like so. And now we're done. Click Add Title. Now we can go down to our timeline and drag it across here. And then we can make it longer just by putting our mouse over top till the arrow shows up, holding down our left mouse key, and dragging it out. Now if we play our video in the window here, you see that it flies in and then it will f fly out again when we get to the end of the timeline where it is. So just watch carefully here. And there it goes. Now if you wanted to make a copy of this, you could just put your mouse on it and do a copy and move your timeline across and then Click up here to put a marker there, and then right-click down here, and just click Paste. Now you've added that down here. If we drag this across now, you'll see that it flies in there, and it flies out at the end. So that's how you can put it multiple times in your timeline, so that way you can brand it more than once in your video. Now at this point, all you have to do is click Publish Movie, and then you click this computer, go to Next, give the movie a name, and then pick where you want it on your computer, and then click Next again. You can select Best Quality is the best thing to do here, and then just click Publish. Now the movie will publish itself, and you're all ready to upload it or to sell it or whatever it is you want to do with it. And that's how you can brand your own video using Windows Movie Maker.